please join me to welcome Mr. Benjamin, but popularly we call him Opposite. Uh, please, you're welcome. Oh, thank you very much, uh, presenter, and um, very good afternoon to you, the viewers. <laughs> it's good to have you. Oh, thank you very much. I must say, he just overrated me. Uh, you know, he's my boss, you know. We've been together for quite some time, and I must say that uh, it's an honor to be on the show with you. Thank you very much for inviting me. <sighs> anyway, thank you very much for coming. Yes, um, let us get to meet Mr. Hop City. Oh, this is the man you guys call Hop City. My name is Ben, and um, I'm an image analyst. We are uh, what you guys would call a photographer. Um, uh, specialize in um, taking excellent images, portrait and beauty photography to be specific. And then um, I've been into this game of photography for quite some time now. Uh, if I could trace my history back as far back as 2007, um, I started the professional studio inside Passport University around 2008, and then uh, I had to take a break, let's say, to to further my studies. And then, uh, to date, I have been the only professional photographer who has uh, set up a professional studio inside Park You know, then we built Busa House. You know, the, the new Busa House that you see. We started from the old Busa House. Uh, some of the students might not even be aware that it was a very old building we were using. Very, very dirty. But we thank God for where Busa is today. That's our fingerprint. You know. uh, I have also been a contract photographer to Pop Up for, let's like, say, about nine years now. You know, uh, I shoot their convocation every year as the official photographer. Um, I'm sure, if not for the break I took to, to you know, uh, improve on my, on my skill. I would have been the official photographer, and I'm not sure if I'll take it up any longer anymore. Anyway, I don't. Know. I just like being working for myself. So this is me, and then I go by the brand name Up City Images. You can check me up on Instagram. I'm sure you'll meet someone. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, um, Up City Images. Um, but let's ask or let get into the nitty gritty of what you do. Uh, you said you're an image analyst. Really? People generally call people like you still photographers or exactly. other things. Now tell us, what is image analysis all about? Okay, uh, we, we refer to a person who, who specializes in telling stories with images. Uh, for instance, my I would say that my strength is events. And that's why you see me coming weddings here and there every time and I'm hardly available. I always say, Ben, where are you today? I'm here and there. So, okay, fine. When we shoot wedding, what we do is not just to capture the moment or just take an image. <clears throat> we start basically from your, your bedroom and from your hotel room if you are using one. Do you understand? So, we tell the story from the scratch to the end. And then, when you go through our images, you don't need to be told that this is what happens. You can follow the events without words, without anything. And vividly could uh, vividly tell what, what, what has transpired, what has taken place. Do you understand? So we tell stories with our images, with our words. Yeah. Um, is there a difference between you that call yourself a image journalist and every regular photographer as well? Uh, well, um, I respect every photographer I meet every day because uh, we are all work in progress and we learn every day, and we never stop learning. But having said that, um, if I must clarify the difference between um, those of all that are professional, because I believe I am not the only one who is who's professional or uh, who has a, who is careful in this field. Okay, other photographers, okay, they basically give you what you represent. For mm -hmm. instance, you are sitting down now, all they do is um, they take your picture and maybe sometimes ask you to smile. But right now, if I'm to take your picture, I will not ask you to smile because I've been analyzing your things. I just I will just ask you to open your mouth a little bit and trust me. So that gives your lips a kind of composition that viewer would like to see. And I'm sure when you see it, you will be happy that is this me. Do you understand? Then give you um, what we call large format image, an <coughs> image that is not um, that's that, that's real that you can relate with. We don't we don't give you an artificial image. Do you understand? So we let you see yourself in a very dynamic way, in a very a very beautified way, and still keep the originality. In of the image. Do you understand? So we go out to any length to ensure that what we give you is nothing less but the best. Do you understand? And we, it could be expensive sometimes, but we are ready to pay the price. But we have a brand that we want to protect and uh, we are willing to take that as a professional to any level. 
at the same time, they are willing to go. So, whether it is costing a little bit there or not, the, what looks like the objective is all you want to do is to make the picture talk. Exactly. Your picture exactly. speaks. Exactly. Mm, that's beautiful. Yes, sir. Uh, I know a lot of the viewers. Okay. Uh, some of them would have been losing the dream, the aspiration <coughs> to be an image journalist like you. Okay. What would you like to say to them? Oh, oh uh, we did have a platform where they can you know, um, achieve their dream. For instance, I currently lecture as a contract photographer at Babcock University, mm -hmm. where we um, teach the foreign level the art of photography. <coughs> okay, it's an entrepreneurial skill <coughs> that they have been mandated to acquire from the federal government. So we teach them how to become a professional photographer. And uh, I, can, I can tell you, my students are doing fantastically well. If you go to their pages on, on the internet, you'll be amazed at what you see. Do you understand? We also have um, classes outside the school that we run private uh, 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 tutorial that we organize for people who, who are passionate, photography enthusiasts. Do you understand? So we tailor them, we, we mentor them uh, in, 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 in the act of photography. So of course, they are free, free to reach me anytime and any day. And trust me, they will be glad they have me. Thank you very much. Thank you. Uh, then you mentioned Babcock University Entrepreneurship Center. Very good, yes. Uh, please, do you think there is um, any positive light to you going to back up entrepreneurship center to get trained in the habits of creative photography and you actually bring your hands on something golden by the time you are up there. Oh wow well, I shouldn't say this on air but I am going to say it. Trust me, whatever you want to do, no matter how, how talented you are, no matter how passionate you are, something is very important has to be put in place and that's what I call the enabling environment. Okay, um, Babcock Entrepreneurship Center is the body of, um, it's an institution so they have more capacity than I can acquire as an individual. Do you understand what I'm, what I'm talking about? So they have that enabling environment, they have that equipment, they have that that, that structure okay that can further um, facilitate the, the, the speedy uh, delivery of, 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 of skills. Do you understand the student? And that's why they have employed the service of professional like us to deliver, you know, to, to, to people who are willing to learn. In fact, not just students, they, they expose these opportunities to. They also, um, you know, accommodate people from outside to come and learn. Like during the summer, they accommodate people from outside to come and learn for six months. And in fact, you will also be issued a certificate from the university. Do you understand that? Yeah, that Babcock name. And I'm sure you know that Babcock itself is a big brand. So you associating yourself with Babcock, trust me, you know, uh, uh, you know, the sky is your, it's not your limit, but starting point. Do you understand? So, of course, there's, there's a huge, huge advantage to coming to Babcock University Entrepreneurship Center. But that's the place that things are happening. Trust me, things are happening there. Believe me. I believe you can get that from him. If actually, you want to nail it, you can find your way to Babcock Entrepreneurship Center. So, whether you go to Babcock Entrepreneurship Center or you just call this up, Up City, personally, I know he knows the right place to direct you to. And uh, as long as you work with him, Magic in the um, Mr. City, yes, we are very, very glad to have you. Uh, hope you never mind this little time to catch up with me. I thought, trust me, the play is much. I am glad to be here. Thank you. We are grateful you came around. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, Slash. All right, my dear audience, there. Uh, it's nice having you here again. I hope we are going to catch up on another episode next week. And so, till then, I remain Shayo Lidari. Your darling host. See you there.